Okay, so here's the new full battle pass for episode 7 Act 2. How I'm going to do this is I'm just going to run through all the rewards now, every single tier, and then towards the end of the video, I'll take a look at some of the skins in game. You can see it's like the knife skin here, the phantom skin here, stuff like that. That'll be at the end of the video in game. For now, here is just all of the other rewards. Starting things off, we have the classic skin right here. You can see it's like actually a little bit animated. I don't normally pay too much attention to the battle pass skins, but I think that's pretty different. So nice there that we have an animated classic skin or like a little bit animated, I guess. You have this buddy right here called the Sunset Scoot, 10 Ready Knight. Then this player card called Freehand, because that is one of the other skin lines in this battle pass. You can see right here the Freehand Ghost at tier 5. We have this Gelato card, free reward, as well as the default title. Literally just title says default, simple as that. We have the Power Punch Spray, then the Transition Spray, another one of the skin lines in this battle pass. 10 more Ready Knight, Transition Player card, and then the Transition Stinger. You can see right there, I'm not a massive fan of how that looks, but... I'm sure there's some people out there that are like that. We, of course, have the Episode 7 Axe 2 Coin Buddy. And we have the card for Panoramic, as well as the spray for Panoramic. Then we're ready night points. The Buddy for this whole Panoramic uh, skin line. And again, the Bucky here, slightly animated. You can see the clouds sort of slowly moving across. 10 more Radiant Knight. Uh, the Raw title. That is one of the titles. Next, we have the Freehand Spectre. Old Rhodes player card. I want to say that's Brimstone. It, looking like i've seen better days uh we have the freehand spray here 10 more radiant knight the panoramic guardian then we have the crane blossom spray loyal look spray you can see this guy's dog there uh 10 radiant knight points the transition gun body oic spray for neon transition vandal play card here for nanobomb that's killjoy and raise 10 more radiant knight points for free now spray here for harbor called the wave rider 10 more radiant knight points techies trouble spray for killjoy uh, the Truvian Wingman card. That's actually pretty cool. I like that one. Um, Freehand Odin. Let's see it The Mid-Autumn Sweep, buddy. We have the No Hand Player card. You can see some of the agents there on a roller coaster. 10 more Radiant Knight. The Alley Oop Gun, buddy. That's a really nice one. Uh, the Great Responsibility Spray for Reyna and Gecko. Transition Bulldog. You can see that one right there. Then Free Rewards. 10 more Radiant Knight. And the Owo title. Um, uh, Raw and Owo titles is Battle Pass. That's gonna... Interesting one. Um, Exit Wind Spray. You can see here another Gun Buddy Terrarium. This one's really nice. Terrarium Treasure. Tick Play Card here for Sage. Obviously, just Battle Sage. Love that one. 10 Radiant Knight Points. The Freehand Marshal. You can see right there. Scribble Squad Spray. That's like a really different style for the sprays, I feel like. That's another free reward. 241's more Radiant Knight. We have this Latest Issue Player Card. This Diffuse Deception Spray. This Perfect Pat Spray. And then this Phantom Skin, which I don't think they've done this before, where it's like this could literally be like the agent contract skin for sorry for deadlock like the agents where are they they all have like their little pistol skins and stuff this right here if i can actually find it again this is literally like deadlock's phantom so i think this is really cool it's a separate skin line there's like no other ones it's just this one phantom standalone that's actually really cool we have the on the low buddy you can see right there and then the last few rewards the roll on spray very nice ups and downs gun buddy Versus card for Jet and Jet. Obviously, the two different worlds. 10 more Ready Knight points. The knife right here. And then the free pistol skin is going to be the Transition Shorty. And lastly, and almost most importantly, is this player card, which is going to be a teaser. So this new duels is only going to be like just over 60 days away when the next new act comes out, like Episode 7, Act 3. Let me know what you guys think of like what they'll be able to do based on this. And then finally, the epilogue rewards are going to be the Alley Oop Buddy and the No Hands player card. Okay, so now just quickly take a look at a few of these skins in game. Obviously, I have the new map Sunset here. Here's the classic I showed you right at the start. This is the classic I showed you guys at the start. These are all not going to have sound, so turn down my game sound a bit. This is the classic skin. Now, here is the free shorty skin that you get towards the end of the battle pass. We have this ghost skin. I think this one was part of the freehand collection. You can see it there. Here is the stinger skin that is going to be in this battle pass. Spectre skin, again, part of the freehand collection, this one. Then we have the Bucky right here. Here's the Bulldog skin in the Battle Pass. Here's what the Guardian is going to look like in game. You can see it there. It's a pretty nice Guardian skin, to be honest. I mean, like for a Battle Pass Guardian skin, I think this one's all right. Then here is the Phantom. Again, it's not going to have any sounds, but I think it's really cool that it's like themed around an agent and it's like an entire rifle skin. I really, really like this. This is the, I already forget what it was called, but it's the Deadlock themed one for the Phantom. And then of course, here is the Battle Pass Vandal as well. Nothing too crazy going on with this one. Here's the Marshall skin that was in this battle pass. Again, freehand. And then the freehand Odin as well. And then finally, we come to the knife. Which, I mean, you can see for yourself the effects here. 
obviously the battle pass knives they're never too crazy i'm not too sure what to think about this one let me know what you guys think of it it's not like you can see that's the inspect animation right there that's going to be the equip animation just default right click default all default animations here which is a bit unfortunate but again it is just a battle pass knife so let me know what you guys think of this battle pass whether or not you're planning on buying it and uh yeah i'll have a few more videos out soon with sunset the new bundle like this bundle so keep an eye out for all that in a second